Can I start? Hong Kong. Sure, you're in charge now. It's you. Okay. <laughs> 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 um, I'm going to talk about an um, important subject for me. And I'll start with a question. What would you do if you discovered that one simple daily choice can save the world? Would you do it? Yes, sir. <laughs> well, I would. So I'm going to tell you today how I discovered veganism and why I decided to become a vegan. Well, it was a regular day. I was checking Facebook newsfeed and my mom posted two videos. I was surprised because I always had barbecues at home. So. <laughs> <laughs> So I decided to watch them. The first one was um, Gary, I don't know what you say his last name. Find out, you have experts Broski. Broski. She's um, yeah, he's an um, um, animal rights activist. And the second one was the Paul McCartney one called If a Slaughterhouse Had Glass Walls, Everyone Would Be Vegetarian. Well, I decided to watch them. And these videos uh, showed me how animals are tortured and killed to satisfy our, our taste and how responsible we are for that cruelty. And how manipulated we are from the food industry. They lie to us. They tell us we need those food to survive, that those foods are healthy. But they make money making us sick. And then the pharmaceutical industry makes money keeping us sick for a longer period of, of time until we die. So after watching and crying I decided not to live on lies anymore. I decided that I don't want to be manipulated anymore. I don't want to be responsible for <laughs> killing animals. I don't want to do something only because I'm used to do it or because everybody else is doing it. You know? I want a better life. I want to be healthy. And I want peace. So I'll start explaining what veganism is because it's still really unknown for most of people. So uh, veganism is more than a diet, it's a lifestyle. Vegans don't eat any animals, including insects. Vegans don't eat any animal products, including eggs, cheese, milk, honey, Vegans don't wear any animal products. Leather, wool, silk, goose feather, fur. Vegans don't consume 
any product with animal ingredients or tested on animals. Vegans don't support zoos, circles, zeroing, or anything that exploits animals. <laughs> so, I'll start talking about the first reason I became a vegan. Oh, I'm trying to become a vegan. Animal cruelty. You are lucky because I cannot show you videos, <laughs> only pictures. <laughs> and I chose live pictures, so you can imagine how worse it is. 58 billion animals are killed each year. That's 6 million animals every hour. That's crazy. That's the way they are treated and kept. That's the way they are killed. That's the way they are tested on. That's the way circles, zoos, sea world, Canada goose treat animals. The second reason is vegan diet is healthy. I have this simple chart to show you that. The more people consume plant food, the less they die from heart diseases and cancer. Vegan diet can prevent and cure Diabetes, cancer, hypertension, hy hypertension, allergies, and so on. Vegans live about 10, year, 10 <coughs> years more than meat eaters. So the question always is about protein. So that's some foods that we can use not to um, need to kill any animal. Plenty of protein. Calcium. I cannot go through details because I don't have time for it, but I can show you if you want later. Iron. Omega-3, we don't need to kill any fish to get omega-3. Vitamin D. And here there is an example about the average cholesterol level of an American. Meat eater, vegetarian, vegan. Okay, you don't wanna eat plants all, all day for the rest of, of your life, no problem. We have enough substitute, fake meat, hot dogs, um, ice cream, cheese, turkey. Um, this is, um, I don't know if it's fish or chicken, hamburgers, even pizza. We already have vegan pizza. Yep. And I'm gonna show you Vegans are not weak. This guy over there is Jim Morris. He's 77 years old. Look at him. This guy is the strongest man in Germany. This lady over here, she's vegan. She's about 74 years old. Her husband <laughs> is about 20 years younger than her. And he has diabetes, hypertension. He takes a lot of pills each day. And she is beautiful and healthy. I have all these except celebrities, vegans and vegetarians.
And the last reason is about our planet. Raising animals for food uses 30% of the Earth's land. It's a lot. Nearly 80% of land def deforested in the Amazon, 80% is now used to cuddle pasture. If all grains that we use to feed animals were directly used to feed people, it would end hunger in the world. Almost one billion people is still suffer from starvation. It takes about 15 times more water to produce animal protein than soy protein vegetable protein. And this is not a lake. This is animal waste. Yes, poop, um, feces, oh. blood. You. So you can imagine what this can do for our environment. We are destroying it. The earth we have. So, I know it's difficult to understand or accept veganism. Because we still torture, murder, slave our own species. But I believe that as soon as we start respecting all animals, all creatures, we'll be able to finally have peace on Earth. So please, don't tell me you love animals if you eat them. Don't tell me you are healthy if you don't pay attention to what you eat. Don't tell me you care about our planet if you don't do anything to preserve it. Think about it. Make a change for the animals, for yourself, and for the planet. Thank you. And I know I had to talk really fast and not giving all the information necessary. So if you want to know something else, you have any questions, that's my Facebook and my email.